Windows Phone App Studio is an app creation tool designed to take you from idea to app in four easy steps. Whether building from scratch or using a template, the steps are the same. First, name your app, keeping an eye on the preview screen for length. Next, write a brief description of your app content and what users can expect. In this example, we'll be building a travel diary for sharing with friends and family. Lastly, customize your logo with a PNG file. First, let's edit an existing data source. Here we are adding new text to an HTML section. You can easily preview sections in the phone at right anytime with just a click on the eye. This is very handy when you're modifying a template. Next, click here to add a section by selecting a data source. Type the name of your new section, which will be viewable to your users. Select the kind of data you'll be adding, then name the new data source. Click on the icon to add content or to edit content in a data source. For this example, let's add a new photo and text for a photo gallery. We've already written our paragraph and sized our photo to 715 by 715 pixels, making this step a snap. Switch to dynamic content for easy updates later on. The last step is to select a page layout which works best for your content. Preview them all and save your favorite. Polish off your app by selecting a background, text and bar color. Next, select and style how the tiles for your app will appear when pinned to the user's start screen. The cycle tile will rotate through up to 9 pages. The flip tile shows a back with more information and the iconic tile shows basic information. Finally, upload custom splash and lock screens relevant to your app. Check to make sure you've included all your information then click Generate. Windows Phone App Studio will email you to let you know when your app is ready. You can download the ZAP file to publish it to Windows Phone Store, or you can download the source code to edit in Visual Studio, or you can immediately download the app to your phone simply by scanning the QR code. Follow the prompts on your phone to install. After choosing Confirm, return to Start and find your app located in your app list. Do this even if your phone returns to the Tap to Open screen. And just like that, you've gone from idea to phone in record time.